Yo, it was good. We're in the next podcast. This is Marcel. I got a question for Amp. Do you really think this nigga James Harden really gonna take out to the championship? Cause me personally, I don't think so. The nigga is not the nigga for that team. This nigga just wants to be the star player and get his bread and throw that shit at strippers. Mm-hmm. So he's gonna take y'all far, him and Joel, but getting a championship, no fucking way. So I wanna know your opinion on that. Okay. Alright, I'm out of here. So he just asked for my opinion, but I want all y'all opinions on this. Yeah. Except you. Because oh. you was at the Super Bowl party and you was talking about my sixes. I was letting you get your shine because you had the whole everybody listening to you. But I was just letting you get your shine. So. Damn, bro. So he was hating on Super Bowl? You think Harden? He was, he was saying, he was talking a lot of nonsense. Hey, you think Harden is taking y'all to the, to the <coughs> fucking ring? Harden is not the piece you need. He's selfish. He not focused on the championship. Mm. You seen uh, one of the main reasons why he got traded? They were saying um, basically like him and KD went to see eye to eye as far as like offense. Like, so KD and Steve Nash want a free flow offense. And, and also James Harden on the ISO. Also, Kyrie came in there with them with that sage. And he was like, nigga, get that stank ass shit out of here, nigga. <laughs> That's funny as <laughs> fuck. I mean, I ain't gonna lie, like, I probably just would have came in late when I knew Kyrie and was also, doing that shit. And also, I would be a little frustrated too. The third nigga you need on your team, he don't, he part time. This right. nigga. Right. This nigga only works 20 hours a week. Yeah, right. I mean, you're definitely gonna have your frustrations, but at the same time, James Harden. I don't. I just don't feel like he's focused on the championship and playing. It'll be different him being in Philly because I feel like they are the most hungry um, of the yeah. teams that he's that he's been to. You know what I mean? Put it this way: we had to do this trade regardless. Yeah, it regardless. You can't. You can't just waste Embiid's prime. And uh, and and Ben Simmons having, wasn't playing. He wasn't playing. We are. We right now. We five. We one and a half games from one. You put you put hard in. I ain't gonna say we. Want, I would want us to win a championship. Of course, you want your favorite team to win a championship. Right, right. Stan, you a Lakers fan? You want Lakers to win every year, no matter. You can't see how it, um, how dress Brooke playing. You right. want you want the yeah. Lakers to win <laughs> all the time. Yeah. I want that nigga off my team. Well, Joe, like Joe, you a you a New York <laughs> Knicks Magic, OKC, <laughs> oh, oh um, Mavericks fan. So <laughs> you want you want <laughs> you want <laughs> one of the <laughs> Shut the fuck up! I told y'all niggas I don't have like I don't go for teams like that no more. I mean, yeah, I always knew I just, you was wherever Melo go. That's what yeah, you're fucking with. yeah, and then and then once. Once he got out the league, I just kind of, you know what I mean? And now that he on the Lakers, it's cool. Or, I mean, when he was on the Lakers, is he still there? Yeah, he's still there. He's still yeah. there. Uh, they I, traded, I can't, I can't watch the Lakers continue. to save my fucking life. I can't watch the Lakers right now. I watch bro, the Lakers. I can't right either. Now. I can't either, bro. I ain't been watching these niggas, bro. I watched I one remember. game. That nigga uh, Westbrook threw up a layup. That bit went so high off the backboard and didn't touch the rim. I was like, I right, you know, this ain't the the the, the Twitter reels are real. The you know what I mean? Like, the powers, bro. Yeah, they not exaggerating. That nigga's ass, bro. I legit thought that, and I mean, you watch the five minute clips on Twitter of this nigga missing every shot, and you see he's in a Laker jersey, so you know that it's from this season, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. But you you just in my head, I'm just like, nah, this wasn't. Regular season, this wasn't. You know, th- th- these niggas was playing scrimmage with a hundred thousand people in the he building. Play, you he know didn't what play preseason at all, bro. I know this, but I'm trying to give him every excuse I can for how ass he's been playing, and it's hard. It's like, yo, and like I say, I watched it in real time, and I was like, yeah, yeah, yeah. I knew it was doing when we signed that. Nigga, I thought, man, I was talking shit for y'all. I was like, man, they gonna do something. I knew that wasn't gonna work, but for the simple fact that Brian is ball dominant, and you can't you can't make Russ an off ball player, bro. True indeed, 
And if you try, if you trying to make him an off-ball player, well, how LeBron likes to play. I mean, I think that that's why gonna he's playing like this. Corner. Yeah, he's going to end up being in the corner, bro. You know what I'm saying? And even with LeBron, like, LeBron should actually be, like, in the high post at this point. You know what I'm saying? Like, 30, you, how, how old is LeBron? 36. Right? Yeah. 38. Yeah, that nigga like 38, bro. You shouldn't be driving from 30 feet now. You know what I'm saying? You're too old for that. So... I know it wasn't gonna work. AD playing like a bitch too, so. Oh, that nigga playing like a hoe. I had seen when they were premiering the All Star jerseys and they had an Anthony Davis one. I was like, why you got this nigga name? Back? <laughs> that nigga ain't going to the All Star. He's got his name tag should be pussy. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Oh, he the new coochie man. That's how I felt about Ben. We finally got him off the team, man. A round of applause for that. Ben um, ten. But ben ten. Bro. How you think he gonna perform on the Nets? Like, just being real, how do you think he's going to perform on the Nets? Oh, uh, I think he's going to be okay on the Nets. I think he's he, going to be good. He ain't, sh- ain't got to shoot no more. Yeah, like, all the pressure good. off him, he ain't got sh- yep. to do nothing no more. I think, but that pass it. I think that he's around people that will be able to help him build his jump shot, too. As far as, like, comp- in, in practice. You know what I'm saying? KD, Kyrie, you know what I'm saying? Like, on a peer-to-peer basis, not from coaching. You know, People got to put this in mind, though. James Harden averaged like 26 points a game. Yeah, Ben Simmons you, ain't doing You that. just lost that. You yeah. got Ben Simmons. Ben so Simmons ain't doing Seth Curry got to step it up a little bit. So, I don't know. And then they got they got fucking LaMarcus Aldridge. I feel like they got rid of uh, – y'all, they got Seth because of Joe Harris is still hurt. Yeah. But I feel like Seth is a good pickup. Yeah, it is. Yeah, Seth is an amazing pickup. Great pick up this. Yeah. The Hooper. He is a fucking he He was out he was on the sixth he was like our second scorer. Ever since the like Bias ain't doing shit. After I his, keep telling I keep telling Banks to buy his ass. I wish we would have traded to buy us also. And we should have packaged Tobias in that deal too, just to get that J. Cole looking bitch off my team. <laughs> I think <laughs> Tobias is gonna But do that would have sank the next Neps cap. My fault, I keep breaking. No, 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 you good. I I just think that he he's gonna be a benefit to you with, with <coughs> Yeah, he's gonna be a benefit because we was looking to looking for Tobias to be the second option. Yeah, and he's he not a second it. option. Yeah, he's uh, a third or fourth option. So now, now he's gonna be in a role to where he can flourish for your team. Like James Harden gonna love that shit because he keep it. Oh, exactly, mm-hmm. exactly. Only thing I'm gonna hate. I hope he don't stunt um, Maxi's growth. That's the only thing. That, that's literally that's the only thing point. I'm worried about. That's a good point. Yeah, because Maxi kind of Maxi kind of ball dominant, but he's still learning the game. So. He could develop another way. Mm-hmm. But as far as the answer Marcel's question, do I think we're going to win a championship? I just don't re- I really know. I don't really know because I can't. I got to go off what I've seen James Harden do. Is the whole, I didn't, I didn't, me personally, I didn't think the James Harden net shit was going to ever work out because I'm going to be honest. I think KD, KD sealed his, he sealed his career. He got him two rings. KD just pretty much out there to play to get his stats yeah, up. Yeah. He's trying to win still is Kevin Gar I mean Kevin Durant. But he his legacy sealed. Yeah, for sure. Kyrie legacy sealed. He got him the championship. James sure. don't got a championship. So I'm hoping when he go into the sixes, he realize, nigga, this is your last chance. Hopefully he watched LeBron and KD do the little all-star um Mm-hmm. Uh, draft, oh, yeah. and he watched how he got neither one of them niggas wanted him. Yeah, hopefully that sink into his head, and he get his shit together. He got the skill. It's just when it comes to the playoffs, he's just like it's just not all there. Yeah, um, like I said, he did I mean, try him when he was on the Rockets, but they had too many injuries. Yeah, but his game play, like the way he played, not sustainable, not for a seven game series. Exactly, because for one, he don't. Of course, like you know how to nigga play or whatever. I mean, at the, at the end of the day, you can know how somebody plays, but you gotta stop the shit at the end. Of the day. Right, right. Yeah. Right. Also, in the playoffs, like his his game not made for the playoffs because he also depends a lot on free throws. Mm-hmm. And in the in the playoffs, they're the, not calling on. Yeah, they they yeah. the rest swallow the whistle. You get half of that. Yeah. But yeah, even so. if he was just to take a little bit of his game and just like play off ball sometimes, that'll open up a whole bunch more shit. It would him. make him more of more of a weapon, honestly. Like, you got to see where he's going. You know what I'm saying? But here's the thing. We still got to beat him. 
Yeah, y'all got a beat. But that's the thing, though. He gonna, he gonna he, he's taking away he from Embiid, though. He got to thing. let Embiid do his shit, though, bro. Yeah. Because Embiid. Embiid is a monster, bro. I got you. But we see it. We got, let's, let's see them play. It's let's probably going to be about two or three weeks go. before he play. But we got, we got to see. But like I said, it's like we just had to do it. I don't see... I don't see what's wrong with uh, adding James Harden to the team. Will we I don't think championship? I don't think it's bad. Nah. I think it's good for the development, and I think it's good for pushing where you can go, like the market in Philly, shit like that. Um, it will help to draw attraction next year if he signs again. You know what I mean? It'll make some options available for people to come. Also, it's one of them things where also – I feel like we probably won't win this season, yeah, but man. if we sit back, look and see what we got, because none of these teams that you put together win the first season. It'll right. take like the second or third. Yep. Maybe we see what's going on. Lakers won the first season, right? That was it. Mm-hmm. Well, the second. Big three. Big three won. It's one in uh, yeah, the Boston. They lost the first. Boston, they won it the first time. Yeah, Boston. Oh, yeah, yeah Boston did. Yeah. That's like the only two teams I like the super teams I can think of that like want to strap their back. Yeah. Most of the time these you, you gotta do it like the second or third year. Maybe we get far this year and Y'all gonna be a good team regardless though. Yeah. Yeah, it, 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 you're definitely gonna be um hard to beat. Also, what do y'all think about the draft pick end of it? Because I feel like niggas overrating the draft picks portion of it. I feel like our draft pick shouldn't matter because we did draft um, Maxi late in the first round, but that doesn't happen often. Nah, that don't really matter, bro. Not if you in a win now situation. The draft yeah. picks not gonna be shit. Yeah, cause them draft picks gonna be like, oh, what are they like? Almost thirty. Yeah. So like, them draft picks really don't matter. Yeah, that ain't gonna mean shit. Bro. Yeah, I think y'all gave up what one this year and one in twenty seven. Yeah, anytime. You yeah, anytime Anything you that you're get, bringing in, you got to be you got to be ready to go right, right. now. Yeah, time yeah. To like I think I think the gamble is for the reward at the end. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like even if you don't win the championship, like I say, I think it does create a bigger market for uh, star players to want to come and play. So yeah, and then also that that draft pick we got Maxi for it. We really don't draft good in the late rounds or in general. Mm-hmm. That draft pick that we got Maxi that was that came from the folks deal. Yeah. So it's like. We don't really right. draft good at often, so nigga, give that pick up. Right. And you yeah. see, we drafted folks, drafted Ben number one, and both the motherfuckers gone now. So fuck that shit. Let's win now. Right. So, hey man, anything better than last year? Losing to off that shit still. <laughs> hey man, I'm looking forward to it. <laughs> now, mean, Malcolm, you gonna feel this? Jaguars, Super Bowl next year. Jaguars, Sixers. Yeah, I wouldn't be. <laughs> hey, bro, I ain't gonna lie, boy. If the if the Jags, if the Jags, I've been shaving my bomb like a year. Hey, and the Gators, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Oh, right, you've gone too far. No. I heard the Gators are going. You're going too far now. Nah. 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 Look, bro, the nigga been shaving that Jags, you know what I mean? Bro, all I can think of, bro, if the Jags win, is a crime rate going. Oh, oh, oh that shit is, yeah. That shit gonna go crazy. That shit gonna go dumb. Nigga, like, I'm staying in the house. Fuck that shit.